folks ever had a great project in mind, but no clue how to make it real? That gap between an idea and a working design? That's where our new platform comes in. I'm Daniel, welcome to my channel where I make smart tutorials. Today we're checking out Paraflow, an AI product design agent that works like both a product manager and a designer on your team. It turns your rough concept into a full product spec, handling everything from documents to interactive prototypes on one connected canvas. It's a perfect tool for designers or entrepreneurs who don't have a full team, because Paraflow steps in to define, design, and hand off your product seamlessly. Don't worry if you're new to tools like this. I'll walk you through everything step by step and show you how I built a student performance dashboard from scratch in under 15 minutes. Also, I've left all the useful links in the description down below, so don't forget to check them out. Let's jump right in. Alright friends, let's start at the beginning. Paraflow is an AI agent for product design. Think of it as your own AI product manager and designer working together. It's a tool that turns your plan into a complete product specification, from documentation and user flows to UI design and prototypes. Everything happens in one infinite workspace where all elements are connected. I want to create a complete minimal version of an educational platform. We'll start with the initial idea and work all the way to a full specification. My goal is to do the entire process in under 15 minutes. At the start, Paraflow acts like a product manager, structuring the project and defining key features. Later, it switches into designer mode, transforming those plans into beautiful, polished visuals. Paraflow is essentially an AI designer that transforms a rough concept into a detailed, structured product plan. Our example today is a student performance dashboard for teachers. It is a platform that helps analyze students' progress, identify problem areas, and make database decisions. Let's start a new project. Here's our empty workspace. On the left, there's a chat with the AI agent. On the right, the space where all documents and designs will appear. I'll start by creating a student performance dashboard for teachers. That's it, just one simple prompt and Paraflow begins working. It immediately gives our project the name Student Perf Dash and starts analyzing the request. Now it creates a task list, defines key features and outcomes, everything needed to move forward. Mates, Paraflow has analyzed our idea and created a complete work plan. It identified core functions, performance tracking, and an early alert system for struggling students. It also included engagement analytics and improvement recommendations. The platform then divided the process into four stages – strategy and feature planning, followed by visual design and interface creation. Once we confirm the plan, the tool automatically begins generating all the documents. So I'll just type a quick confirmation. And here we go, the process starts. Step by step, the AI works through the checklist. Right now it's creating the product charter, a general description of our dashboard product. Immediately, we can see documents appearing on the workspace, product charter, user persona, and feature plan. Others like PRD, user flow, and dashboard overview follow right after. Guys, it even generates a style guide in three versions, light, dark, and comfortable mode. We can watch as it produces screens and prototypes, like the dashboard layout in several styles. What's really impressive is that Paraflow created three different stylistic variations of the demo. Each version includes the dashboard and student list in the same structure, so we can compare and choose our favorite. Now it's generating the performance analytics screen, again in three creative and flexible designs. Guys, let me take a little break to ask you to like this video and subscribe to my channel. It's absolutely free, but helps me make even more fun tutorials for you. Thanks! My friends, once everything is ready, we can review all the screens. Everything is neatly designed and logically organized. You can really see how the product manager's structure meets the designer's creativity. Now it's time to make an interactive prototype. I'll simply ask it to create an interactive model connecting these screens. The platform checks if anything is missing, finishes incomplete sections, and then links everything into a working demo. And here it is. Paraflow has created a fully clickable prototype. We can open it and interact with each component. The student list, performance analytics, 
and all the generated screens. Everything works perfectly. You can see button animations, hover effects, and smooth page transitions. Our minimal product version is now completely functional and ready to use. The next step is to hand the specification over to developers or to an AI coding tool. All generated documents, including the feature plan, PRD and diagrams, can be exported to GitHub or shared directly. We can invite other users, make the project public or export it as a development package. Let's ask for the export options. It immediately creates a new task list for export preparation. First, it generates project documentation for GitHub. Then it builds the front end, packs everything into a single file, and adds setup and commit details. And here's the result. A full GitHub export package is ready with all the commands and files developers might need. All right, my friends, let's wrap this up. Paraflow isn't just another design tool, it's your teammate. Combining the structure of a product manager with the creativity of a designer, this platform helps you move confidently from idea to clear specs, from specs to prototypes, and from prototypes straight into code. It works for everyone, from product managers to indie developers. No big teams or complex workflows needed, just your ideas and Paraflow. With it, the journey from concept to product becomes clear, structured, and fast. If you're excited to try it out, or if you've already used it and have some thoughts to share, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your experiences. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching, until next time.